Yesterday on the 21st of May, the new Forza Horizon 5 update actually came out. And already today on the 22nd, we have the new Forza Horizon 5 mod menu, which gives you a lot of fun and free things in Forza Horizon 5, guys. In today's video, I will show you how to use it, how to install it, and pretty much how to have fun with it. So if you're interested in that, just keep watching the video. So first thing first, I'll show you how to download this mod menu and pretty much how to use it because it's not all that easy and fast. You do need to know a couple of things, otherwise it will not work for you. So let's get to it. There will be two links in the description of this video. One will be for the mod menu itself. You have to download it there. And the other one is even more important. That's the one for mod menu to work. So let's go to the first one. That's the net 8.0. If you click on it and pretty much I'm going to refresh it. It will be downloading immediately. If it's not just click on this link and it will go to download. What you need to do is you need to open it up and then will it pretty much install it on your PC. It doesn't do really much except for enabling the mod menu to work. Then you go to the second link and this will be this link. This is the Git hub where the mod menu, shout out to this guy for making the mod menu. Uh, let's go to this one. Pretty much we don't need the source code zip file and the tar file. That's for the more advanced people if they want to like mess with it. Right now we're not doing that. We're going to the Forza Mods IEO, click on it and it will pretty much go and install in your PC. So when you install it, sometimes it can say it's a virus, so it's maybe not a virus. As you can see, my Windows is saying, oh, do you really want it? You more advanced and yes, I do want it. So you're going to have and allow it to be used on your PC pretty much. And after a while, it will open it up. So this is the mod menu itself. The first thing first is if you don't have this thing, this will not be able to open. So get this thing first and then only download the mod menu. Otherwise, it will not work. So the next thing is go ahead and open your Forza Horizon 5 game so the first thing that you need to do for this mod menu to work is smash that like button on my video the next thing is go to the mod menu so there's a bunch of things we have in the mod menu which is pretty much the auto show garage we also have the self vehicle and the tuning the auto show garage is pretty much disable or uh, display all cars i mean display only rare cars make cars free which is really nice because you can pretty much buy all cars for zero cr you have also fixed car thumbnails, clear garage, clear new text on cars, a bunch of things. So you can go ahead and try these out. What's also really interesting is the self slash vehicle, which is pretty, pretty fun because we have unlocks here. We have the credits, we have the XP, will spin, skill points, uh, accolades, kudos, and a bunch of other things. Pretty much go ahead and put, for example, XP. We can go ahead and do like, uh, let's do like, for example, 1 million XP. Let's go ahead and put it on free clothing we also let's put that on too and we have also photo mode so for example this thing i'm 137 uh, 137 you do need to go ahead and just drive for a little bit do a little bit of things make maybe uh, some more xp because it's not going to change if you're not doing anything so you do need to do some things like race or drift or do anything at all because if you're not doing anything to change the xp value it will also not change when you're doing it with the mod menu. So as you can see, boom, I was 137, now I'm prestige one, uh, level three, I think. Let's go again to the mod menu and let's do again the same thing, but let's do it with, for example, like 50 million. So let's put it on again. See this, prestige one, level three, get out of it. And again, as I said, go ahead and drift a little, do something. Don't be standing and expecting it just to pop up. So do a little bit of slides, do a little bit of drifting, do a little bit of I don't know what. And as you can see, Prestige 4, level 472, which is actually crazy. So the, the XP is working really fine. We can also go to right now disable it for now, go for credits. And as you can see, I have 890 mil and then 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Let's change it to, for example, 95 mil. So let's do that. You go out of it. You can also do maybe like uh, you can also do maybe a will spin if you have spins. As you can see, I have twenty one thousand spins. So for example, you get a little bit of things. You can go into the garage, and as you can see, nine hundred fifty mil, and I also got forty five thousand, which pretty much added on top of it. So this also works really fine. 
Let's go for wheel spins, for example. It's the regular wheel spins or the, the super wheel spins. I think the regular ones, right? I think the regular ones. So let's see how many. I have 18,000 wheel spins. So let's skip this part. Actually, I want this car. I already have it. Uh, sell. And I have 18,000 of those. Let's put, like, I don't know, like 50k. Let's turn it on. Let's go to the wheel spins. Use one. And as you can see, this will change in a bit. So sell, boom, 49,999 will spins, guys, which is actually crazy, right? How are you going to spend that in your lifetime in Forza? So pretty much after doing a bunch of that, let's uh, let's change from the from the will spins or from the unlocks at least. We have also handling, which is a bunch of things, right? We have uh, strength limit, we have mode strength. We have uh, movement speed, which is kind of cool, guys. Let's do movement speed, like. Let's do let's do that movement speed ten. Let's do movement speed. Mm, how fast is it going to work? To be honest, that's a really good question. Movement speed, rotation, fly hack. Oh, I'm interested in this one. Will I be able to fly? Let's see, let's see. I'm kind of curious. Maybe I will. Maybe we need to wait. I haven't used this one, to be honest. Let's uh, find something that I can jump off. I probably will be fine. I'll, like, smash into. So I'm not really seeing this. This might actually go in full work, but in a little bit. So let's keep it on. Super brake, let's disable that. No water drag, no clip. Stop all wheels. Let's for now continue with the other. We have the photo mode, which is also pretty cool, but I'm not gonna show it. You can just figure it out on yourself, for yourself. Environment, we can actually change the environment. So I would actually like it to be like a Mexico, you know, like the Mexican movie, Sun RGB, let's do that. And let's, let's this is fine, this is fine. Man. So we do need to go out for now because it doesn't go on like in a whole instance. So we do need to change a little bit a little something so let's go for this halo okay you'll see it for yourself in a bit it will change i think that if we do it maybe with red color it will be better i think maybe let's do it with maybe let's do it with green color actually strong rgb let's do intensity like on what's the max max stand right boom as you can see it did change a little <laughs> The Sun RGB is dead, but it's not really like something that you would be doing a lot, right? So let's go to customization. We have glowing paint. Ooh, that's pretty cool, right? That's pretty cool. Dirt, mud. Let's do glowing paint and let's do like glowing paint and let's do, for example, black. Headlight color. Ooh, that's headlight color. Let's do headlight color red, for example. Headlight color. Enable. We also have camera here. Which is pretty much you can play with the camera. You have Miscellaneous. I'm not even sure how you say it. Name spoofer pretty much. And you have also tuning. Which is also really nice. But you do need to scan first. So it will take like a couple of seconds. If you have an older computer. It will take like 10 seconds. 20 seconds. Maybe even longer. I should be fine. But it's taking already way too long. <laughs> but let's just do it. So the scan is done. You have tires. You have gearing. Alignment, springs, damping, steering, we have also other wheelbase. So pretty much we have springs. Let's do front springs mix. Let's do like let's do like eleven front right height centimeters. Let's do also like pull. Let's see what changed actually. I did some things but I'm not sure if it's still changed, so let's go to my horizon and change some values in the game. For example, let's do a wheel spin cell. Maybe we'll see. It. So I'm not really seeing it right now. Because I did the glowing part, but it's right now uh, a little bit dark, and I also did it on black, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna see it right now. Oh, you do see it actually. Because as you can see here on the on the ground, you can see it's red. Oh, that's pretty cool. So the headlights are actually red. I can see that they are red, but you can pretty much see the red on the uh, on the on the ground on the highway, which is pretty cool actually. 
So that's also working really well. So for pretty much you can do whatever you want with the thing, but the most of you will be probably using the unlocks, which is pretty cool also because you can do whatever you want with it. Season points also, series points, <laughs> series points, series points, a bunch of things, and of course the make cards for free. Be aware you do can you you can get a ban for this guys. It also depends on how you use it because if you're pretty much teleporting, doing like things like that, messing with other players, they will report you and you will get a fast ban. If you're using it carefully, you should be fine, but there is always a chance of getting banned because a lot of questions have been asked in the comments of the, vi of the previous video and a bunch of you are asking like, hey, uh, like what are the chances of getting banned? Well, using cheats, mods or anything else like... Uh, changing something in the game the devs don't like it like almost every single game so you can get banned getting banned is pretty much getting banned from online that is always a chance so be aware if you want to use it be aware of the risks of it this was it for today i hope you enjoyed it have fun guys you know you can do a bunch of things have fun if you want of course and uh, if there will be a new video or there will be a new uh, i mean a new update i will make a new video for you guys so the faster uh the new uh mod menu comes the first time uploading it i'm pretty much one of the first youtubers that's upload updating you guys on this new things like the mod menu for forza horizon 5 also have a bunch of other things so if you're new to the channel if you're interested go ahead and subscribe you will be able to see a bunch of fun things on the channel have fun thanks for watching and have a great day guys bye bye